Hi there reception children, it's Misty Hurtsley here at school. Come outside again because it's another bright sunny day. Gardeners are also here too, so you might just hear them cutting the grass every now and again. I'm going to read a book to you today called Fergus's Upside Down Day. Wonder what an upside down day might look like. Let me see the front cover, there's Fergus, I didn't think Fergus is the dog there. What else is going on? Looks a bit strange, doesn't it? Pig in the shower. I think Fergus might live on a farm. We're off to the market, Fergus called Farmer Bob. Look after the animals and make sure they don't get into any trouble. A nice quiet day, thought Fergus. Nothing to do but sleep in the sun. He looked around, the hens were in the yard, the ducks were by the pool, and the pigs were in their pen. Everything looks straight so far. In the orchard, the goat was looking for fallen apples, and the cow was grazing in the meadow. All seemed well. I think I'll bury my bone behind the barn, thought Fergus. When he returned some time later, there was no sign of the hens, or the ducks, or the pigs, or the goat, or the cow. Where do you think they've all gone? Then he noticed the open farmhouse door. He looked inside to see the hens and the ducks watching television. He went through to the kitchen there were the pigs eating spaghetti and baked beans. He rushed upstairs to the bedroom to find the goat wearing the new hat and coat that Farmer Bob's wife had just bought. All getting a bit upside down now, isn't it? And when he opened the bathroom door, he couldn't believe his eyes. The cow was taking a bubble bath. Suddenly, the clock struck four. Farmer Bob and his wife would be back at any moment. Woof, 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 went Fergus as he hurried the animals outside. Quickly, he switched off the television, washed the plates and had just finished tidying up when Farmer Bob's truck pulled into the yard. Phew, just in time, thought Fergus. But had he forgotten anything? He tried hard to remember. What about the cow? Was she still in the bath? Fergus groaned and closed his eyes. The next thing he heard was Farmer Bob's voice. Wake up, Fergus, we're home. Bet you've had a nice quiet day. Humph, thought Fergus. A quiet day be blowed. It's been an upside down day. But when he looked around the farm, everything seemed quite normal. And not much to his surprise, the cow was back in the meadow. Fergus gave a big sigh of relief. Whew, it must have been a dream after all, he thought. Or was it? I think we've all had a few little upside down days since this lockdown started, children. Enjoy the sunshine today. Look forward to reading you another story soon. In the meantime, Remember, if you see someone without a smile, give them one of yours. Keep on smiling.